I had a viewer that was asking me about this, and I tend to like to do silly things like this. Uh, is R410A, that's what this is, is it flammable? Well, yes and no. R32, which is half of what this is, 50% of this is R32, and it's got methane in it. So yes, it is very flammable. The other refrigerant that's in it is R125, which appears to be not really flammable. Sometimes the MSDSs are a little hard to understand here. But it does not appear to be very flammable. And the R125 is actually supposed to be kind of a uh, fire extinguisher for 32. Well, does that really work? Does that make sense? You know, and a simple test could actually tell us this. Now, I've got this. And a happy hose. Uh, and I'm going to turn this upside down because I don't want to ruin my cylinder by uh, releasing gas, which would upset the blend. Uh, 410A doesn't separate easily, but okay. So I'm going to try it with a torch. Hot torch, very hot torch. Then I have an electric element that I'm going to energize and get it turning red and see if it will ignite. Of course, it's at least 1,500 degrees. So uh, ignition points in these things are around 1,000. So let's just see what happens. First thing I'm going to do is try it with this element. Okay, the element's glowing. Trying to get some wood on fire. Very low flow here. Well, if you look really close, you can get a little bit of flame on the other side of the element over there, but boy, I'll tell you what, it's not going to establish flame and, and keep it going. Even with that hot element. So, is this stuff uh, flammable? I don't really think so. Let's try it with a flame. Now here, we have an oxyacetylene flame that's pretty close to 6,000 degrees at the very tip. Let's see what it does. Well, it'll establish flame. It doesn't stay on there very long. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you can you can catch it on fire, but you have to work pretty hard. Maybe if you mix some oil with it, it might do it. Okay. Here I have some oil. This is refrigerant oil. Uh, that I have preheated. Yeah, more than anything else, it just puts it out. Okay, can I say this stuff is flammable? Well, obviously I can't can't say for all conditions, but even in the presence of hot oil, it really didn't do much. It, uh, it's more like blowing air across it or something like that. So uh, I wouldn't be too concerned about this stuff being flammable. I just don't think it's an issue. Okay, that's it on this one.